know, I, we all like you. And we, you know, we appreciate the fact that your recovery's taking a lot longer than we expected, but you're not helping. Joel, so, what does the best man in the wedding do? Well, I think you're missing the point, Gower. Gower? Over here, Gower? With you. Um, so, I mean, we've made some progress in 16 months, but really it's nothing like... Uh, we have? I don't see it. I really don't. Well, tell me, what do you think the problem is? The problem as I see it, and correct me if I'm wrong, but I have no freaking idea who I am. Gower, I have told you many times who you are. And why should I believe you? Who are you to say who I am? Because I am your psychiatrist, Gower. So you say. But as far as I know, this could be one of those Mission Impossible type scams, like maybe I've been brainwashed or something. Hey, now you're making me crazy. Joel. This is a very clever way for you to avoid the question, isn't it? What question? What does the best man in a wedding do? Oh, right. Uh, you know what? I see what you're getting at. I think this is a really good sign, Gower. You know, uh, what the question really means is a symbolic sense that you are now ready and feeling confident enough with yourself to reach out and be with other people. In fact, starting to share... I said, what the fuck does a best man in a fucking wedding do? I didn't ask you for a fucking lecture!